There's not a day that doesn't go by that someone doesn't call us at U.S. Water and ask, do you have salt-free water softeners? Or do salt-free water softeners work? Or I'm thinking about buying a salt-free water softener. Or maybe they've got a complaint about a salt-free water softener. And I say a day doesn't go by, we get multiple inquiries a day. I mean, there may be 10 or 12 people that call a day asking this question. If you go on the internet and Google salt-free water softeners, you're going to come up with about 10 million answers. And when you read it, you're going to even be more confused. So look, I'm going to try to take some of the mystery out of salt-free water softeners. First of all, let me say that at U.S. Water, we have nearly 10,000 products. We don't believe any one product fits all sizes. That said, there's a lot of companies out there that are selling a very narrowly focused line of products, those being water softeners that they say do not use salt. If you're buying a salt-free water softener, how do you know it's working? The Water Quality Association supplies the definition and soft water is water that is below one grain per gallon of hardness. Hardness is a measure of weight. For instance, a bare aspirin tablet is about five grains. A water softener takes that to below one grain of hardness. So if you have a salt-free water softener, logically, it should do the same thing, right? Well, I wouldn't leave it to chance. If you think you have a salt-free water softener or you're thinking about buying a salt-free water softener, we have a professional water analysis test kit for hardness. This is the same one that water treatment companies use. It's very inexpensive. Inside, you've got three chemicals. Uh, you've got a little mixing vial here. And you're going to draw the water from your tap. You're going to fill it to the top of this little graduated uh, tube here, this little tube, and you're going to pour it into the mixing bottle. And then you're going to add three drops of hardness number one, which is one, two, three. And then you're going to add three drops of hardness number two. One, two, three. Now, if the water is soft, that water is going to be blue, okay? You can see it's not blue, it's kind of a purple color. So every drop of this until the water turns blue is one grain of hardness. And so we're gonna start adding it. We're gonna add one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is very hard water. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Maybe one more, 18. And 18 gets us nice and blue water, okay? So this water is 18 grains of hardness per gallon. Now, a water softener is going to take that down below one grain of hardness. Now, I also have some soft water right here. And I'm going to add the soft water. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to put one, two, three drops of hardness number one in there. I'm going to put one, two, three drops of hardness number two. And the water's pretty blue right there, uh, but if we put one drop in, it was less than a grain of gal per gallon of hardness, and that water's really blue. So if you have a sulfury water softener, Test your water. Buy this test kit on our website. We'll send it to you. You can test your water to see if your salt-free water software is working. I think you're going to be surprised at what you find because you're going to find that it isn't softening the water. The water hardness is the same as it is coming in. And if that's the case, the question, it begs the question to me, why would anybody call a system that doesn't soften water, a water softener, unless they're trying to deceive you. For instance, right here is a some Kleenex. You know, it's nice and soft and used to wipe your nose. You also have paper towels. You know, they'll kind of substantially work the same, but we call a Kleenex a Kleenex and a paper towel a paper towel because they're different. A water softener 
and a water conditioner are different. We sell the Green Wave salt-free water conditioners, but we don't call it a softener because it does not take the hardness out of the water. It simply puts it in a state where it won't attach to anything. We call it restructuring the water so that it's not going to form scale. But it doesn't soften the water. And we don't call it a salt-free water softener because we think that's deceptive. And the fact is, it does not soften the water as you have seen in the test. You want to know the truth? That's the truth. The truth is, there is no such thing as a salt-free water softener, but there are some very good salt-free water conditioners out there, and we happen to sell one of the best. If you have more questions, visit us at uswatersystems.com, look at our website, look at our blog, askthewaterdoctor.com, or call one of our 12 certified water specialists at 800-608-8792. This is The Water Doctor. Thanks for watching.